everyone, this is Maria, okay, Maria again. So today I will introduce you how to develop our T5 USC to display because it's not the gas, it's our another system. It's about uh, instruction uh, set display. So the develop development way is different as the gas. So, and I got some inquiries uh, from our, my customers about how to develop this display. So today I will show you some how to say some command, how to set command, and how to how to show the digital number also the uh, text. Okay. Uh, okay. Here is my how to say my my something I want to show you for this today's video. So first, here, uh, this is the files. What's this file? It's the application guide for T5 USC2. And here you can see the instruction set mode. This is the mode where I want to show you and I, I will use later in, in my project. And here, uh, this one is for the HMI display. So for this command set, it's, it's how to say, it's more clear than the previous one and it's based to different, different uh, serial port protocol this is the data frame structure i want to show you and i will use it later and here you can see this is today's display this is the seven inch display it's, it's quite how to say classical this is the model number maybe you have the same model number as as me or maybe some larger model number or maybe some smaller smaller display and here uh, here the interface is for the 8 pin collection wire and for this display there are two how to say two interface uh, if off is TDL if on is uh, 232 uh, okay uh, if off is 232 if on on is TTL yes sorry <laughs> okay so now I, I will use 232 for this display and and here, this is the adapter I will use. Uh, I bought it uh, in, in Taobao, you know, Taobao, Chinese online shopping, shopping mall. So this is the adapter. This is for 232. And here is for RF485, also TTL. And this is the USB. I want to use it for the communication with the PC, with the computer. And, the, and this, this is the 8 pin collection wire we sold we sell this collection wire and here this is for this and this part is for the power the power is around um, 6 6 to, to 15 voltage and this is the power okay so now I will I will put all together and show you how to do okay uh, so here if you if you first firstly use our T5 USC2 display or other instruction set display because we have different types for uh, for instruction set display and we do the up, uh, upgradation. So here, this is what I prepared. Uh, this is the application guide. There are two, and also the software will too is Terminal Assistant six. Here you can select port. And board rate, factory, factory board rate for the display is normally 115200. And you can select open port. Now you can click handshake. Or why do you collect, uh, why to click handshake? Because you will check if the communication is well. If not successful, then there are some, some bug in the interface or in your wire or in the display. Uh, you can't achieve the communication so here let me check after after click handshake you will see communicate successful if you see this which means the communication is good you can you can do the after uh, steps okay okay here here is the is the page I put uh, same same as the as the display so now I want to show you something special because you can see there is only a picture. I want to show some digital number 
in this display in some uh, specific, specific location. So here, what shall we do? Let's say the guide. This is the T5 URC2 uh, guide for the instruction set. Okay, let's say instruction here. Can you see it? Six, seven, eight, nine is for the for the put to show the strings. This is the instruction. You will use this, and this is X Y data is the location position, and the strings is is what you want to show. And here, this is the function display strings. This is the font. Uh, actually, in this display, in the factory display, we have put some font ID into it. You can use it directly. Okay, let's see. Here, this is the uh, factory uh, demo. Here is the picture. Yeah, and uh, this is the zero font, and uh, this also font. And this is the safety. Uh, now, since the display has the font ID, uh, I will show you something special. I will use 29, this, uh, this, uh, this one. Uh, sorry, I will use this one, uh, 23, because uh, this is GBK font. If for GB2312, I, I may not show the digital number because it's only Chinese. So here, this is the font ID, 16. So 23, font ID is 23. So based, based on the guide, okay, 23, display strings, this is the function description. So if I want to show this font, I shall use 54, this command. Okay, do you understand it? Uh, am I clear here? And this, here you can see this is the data frame structure. AA is the fixed header, always, always fixed header. And this, this is the command. Now the example is 70, but if we want to show, show the font, now here, here is the 54. So I should use 54. And here, this is the data. The maximum bias is 248. And here, this is the frame end. Uh, so it's fixed. We only need to change this part and this part. And this part, you can refer on this, this part. Okay, so now uh, I want to show you 54 here. Uh, okay. Okay, this is another assistant tool. It's for only for the debugging. So I select the port, open file. Okay, wait for a minute, okay. Uh, okay, so based on this frame structure, let's see. First is AA. AA is the first because it's the fixed frame header, and then it's the command. Command here is 54, so I shall write 54. After 54, you can say we shall write x, y, is the uh, location for the strings for your text. So here, I want to show uh, this, 0064. 0064 means the position is 100, so the x, direction is 100, the y direction is 100, it's the hex format. For D1 display, always use hex format. And then this is the strings you want to show. Uh, I want to show 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 8. So here. 31 means, means uh, 1, 32, 33, 34, 35, 38, 37. This is the data I, I want to show you. And here, frame A end. This is to four bytes. CC33, C33, C. Okay, here. CC33, C33, C. This is the 
oh, command I need to show to the display. Okay, send. Let's see the display. You can see there is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is how how D1 instruction set display works. Okay. Goodbye.